Okay, so um, I want to make sure I announce that, um, um, as Frank mentioned, uh, I, I coach the Poetry Slam team. I also have a program in Rochester City High Schools and through Writers and Books that is called Slam High, and I work with three or four hundred kids a, a year in this program. And so um, our grand event, our grand slam, is coming up on April 26th at Hochstein Performance Hall. So um, there's flyers out there, but if you want to jot it down, if you want to want more poetry um, on April 26th at 6.30 at Hochstein Performance Hall downtown. Please come. I guarantee you, you'll, you'll definitely enjoy yourself. So this is a piece actually that I wrote um, for my students last year. I'm gonna perform this piece, another call and response for you, and that'll be my last piece. Um, it's called uh, Poets of Change, and um, it stems from a theme um, that I work with uh, as part of this program, as poets, as an agent of social change, and um, and it's something I, I deeply believe in, and I, so I wrote this piece for my students uh, to remind them why I do what it is that I do. So this is it. So the call is, you are the poets, and when I say you are the poets, you say, you know it, okay? I say, you are the poets, and you say what? You know it. All right, here we go. Let's see if this thing picks me up at all. Test, test, is that good? All right. You are the poets. You, know. you are the seers and knowers who will count and be counted amongst the keepers of time, of history, of life, of knowledge, of truth. You are the poets. You, know. you are the ones who will write the new stories and retell the old ones with new turns and twists. You will shape the tomorrow promises and blend the today memories into clay, into mortar, into flint, into stone. You are the poets. You, know you are the ones who will sing the wind song and break through the foggy mist that hides the lies, the snickering cowards. You will slay them with your fearless observations and carefully paraphrased quotations meant for believers only. You are the poets. You, know. you are the poets. You, know. you are the poets. You, know. you are the last b-boy and b-girls, the last painters and sculptors, the last warriors and queen mothers, the last orators and griots, the last originals, the last idealists, the last realists, the last sayers, the last players. You are the last poets, so write with visible ink, erase nothing, make permanent and clearly identifiable your mark. Pass the plate around and contribute your most precious jewels. Dance wildly and shake loose the words. Sleep with a pen in hand. Wake and remember your dreams. Record them and read them over before sunrise. Memorize your thoughts. Carry your journal always and write even when you don't. Read everything and rearrange the words often. Case your world. Find your stays. Leave nothing off your page. Eat well-balanced meals. Feed your mind with love, light, and beauty because that is what poems are made of and poems are what life is made of. And in life, you must know and never forget that you are poets. No. And real poets are what change is made of. Yeah.